back, everybody. So glad you guys decided to come see us. Welcome. Welcome, welcome. So, Nick, what do you want to do today, buddy? Swimming pool. You want to go in the swimming pool. What about the surfboard? You want to go on the surfboard? Sure. No, thank you. You don't think that's a good idea? Yeah. I think it'd be a lot of fun. Sure. Swimming pool? Swimming pool, huh? Okay, well, we can do the swimming pool, too. Mm -hmm. I like that idea. Do you want to try going on the surfboard? Surfboard? Surf the... Surfboard? Surfboard? Okay, no surfboard. We don't have to go on the surfboard. Huh. Can we just bring it with us, just in case you change your mind? No surfboard. All right, so do you want to have some chicken? Go home and have some chicken? All right, so we'll start with some chicken, and we'll take it from there. What do you think? Take no surfboard. All right, no surfboard. So, so what do you want to do? Swimming pool. All right, we can go to the swimming pool. I think that's a great idea. So you don't you don't want to go to the beach. So one of the beach. No beach. So for beach. We usually have a really good time at at the beach. You don't want to go. The beach. No beach. The beach. Okay. Do you want me to take the surfboard out of the car? Yes. And put it back in the garage. Yes. Yes. I think it'd be a lot of fun if we tried it. The surfboard. You want to go to the swimming pool? All right, Nick. You got it. That's what we'll do. Go inside, have some chicken. Oh, we're gonna pick some cucumbers too. What do you think about that? Oh, you're very cranky. Very cranky. All right, so that's what we'll do. I'll put the surf. I'll put the surfboard back in the garage. We'll have some chicken. We're gonna pick some cucumbers out of the out of the garden. And then we'll go to the pool. Okay. Okay. That's what we'll do. Come on, let's go get the cucumbers. Come on, come on, come on. You ready? Come on, we're gonna go right over here. Come on. Come on, Nick. So, Nick, Nick. Come here, handsome. Come on, Nick. Here, I'm gonna show you. Look, look, watch. We're gonna take the scissor. Nick. Look, we're gonna take the scissor. And we cut it right at the top. You wanna try that? Nick, you want to try it? No, thank you. One cucumber, one cucumber, and then we'll do the iPad. No! And then we'll go swimming. What do you think? Come on, we can do it. Mama? We got the bowl, we have a scissor. You love using the scissor. Watch, watch. Hey, hey, it's all right. And then we're gonna eat it. Look, Nick. Eat it. Go ahead, look. Come here. Come on, Nick. Let's go. Go on, get them You take the cucumber. Come on, get it now. And then you cut it. Come on. And then you put it in the bowl. Come on, Can you do one? Here, I'll hold it. I'll hold it, and you cut it. Cut it right. Come on, Nick. Good job. Good job. You did it. You want to get some more, or are you all done? More? You want to get another one? There's more. Let's see. Yeah, more? You, let's see if you can more, find more, one. More, more. Look, you see one? Here's one. <gasps> Look at the size of this thing. <laughs> nice job. I'm gonna eat this. Eat this. All done? Oh, you want to find some more? Some more? I think there's more in here. Let's all see. Done. Help me find all them. Done. All done. All done. You can be all done. You can be all done. You did. No, all done. Great. Let's find all one. All done. Let's see. All, all, all done. All done. All done. All done. Well, that was a little small. Oh my god, no. no you see any more cucumbers in here, handsome? Oh my god. No, I don't. No, I don't. No, I don't. Yes! See any? Yes! Yeah. Uh, I don't see any. Oh, that, oh, that, oh, that! You want to go use your iPad? Oh, no, no. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. Look, we have, we have four cucumbers. I think there's more. I think there's more out here. Oh my goodness. Look at the size of this one, Nicholas. What size? Come here. There's a giant Ooh. one here. Size. Cut it for me. Right here. Come on, Come on. Slow, nice and slow. Come on. Nice and slow. Come on. Here, right here. Go ahead, you do it. Go ahead, you do it. More. More. Last one, then you go inside. You did it. All done. Good job. Give me five.
Now it's time to fill in the catch. All right, nice work. No so the surfboard idea was just a disaster. And I, and I really didn't expect that, frankly. I mean, because we've been going to the beach all summer and he absolutely loves it. So, you know, I mean, you could tell from the video, the moment I pulled up to the skull with the surfboard sticking out of the Jeep, uh, you know, he just got into an odd mood. Um, and he made it really clear, no beach, did not want to, doesn't want anything to do with the surfboard or the beach today, and he wanted to go to the pool. Um, and a lot of times I have to kind of weigh and measure that because sometimes he's just nervous to, you know, break, to the, break the routine. We've been going to the pool, you know, almost daily. Um, and then once we're at the destination that he's protesting about, he seems to be fine. But, you know, he just seemed a little bit, um, I don't know, more nervous than usual. So we decided, forget the beach today. We'll try it tomorrow because Shannon's off and she really wants to go. And, we'll, you know, we'll try again. So we're down here at the pool. And since uh, we have one of Nick's uh, service providers today, uh, Evan, who's um, with Nicholas and Johnny is with him as well. Uh, I get a chance to, you know, take a take about a 45 minute break or so, and I got about seven minutes left. So I headed on down to Starbucks, and so I just want to add this piece. Just by chance, I ordered a cold brew caramel salted foam thing, and it was fantastic. I mean, it was just it was just off the charts good, uh, which I really didn't expect because I'm I usually leave Starbucks, you know, somewhat disappointed, but this was great so if you're you know if you're in the mood for a cold brew that's what you should order remember that that's a little free tip no extra charge for that piece so you know some something i wanted to talk about uh which is a highly controversial topic which i didn't think was highly controversial until i you know started sharing my opinions on uh some facebook um autism support groups uh, is the use of cbd oil and CBD oil is um, extracted from marijuana, marijuana plants, right? And it is um, somehow, uh, it's possible to take this oil and leave the THC behind. And THC is the chemical compound in marijuana that gets, gets people high, right? And so, you know, and that wasn't something we really wanted to do with Nicholas. But there have been examples of people who have shown, um, you know, decreased anxiety and nervous behaviors uh, with the use of this oil. And there's not a lot of there's not a lot of research out there. So we, we decided to take a chance um, based on the fact that there are very few reported side effects, negative side effects that could happen. So we said, you know, what's the worst case scenario and, and some of the side effects that are documented are, you know, things like dry mouth or drowsiness. Um, and so, you know, we decided it was worth a shot. And since, you know, toward the end of the school year, and I think it was March or so, where some of his behaviors were becoming a little bit more extreme, we said, let you know, let's give it a shot. And, and keep in mind, we've never used any um, medication to control Nick's behaviors. And that was really based on the fact that, you know, his behaviors aren't all that extreme, right? And so, you know, I understand that there are people, um, you know, who have, you know, much bigger issues to deal with in terms of um, behaviors. Nicholas, he doesn't show any behaviors that are a danger to himself or to anyone else. And so it was really just us trying to focus on, you know, his anxiety and those nervous behaviors that he shows. How many times can I say the word behavior in a minute? That's, that's a lot. Anyway, so we tried, we started using this oil in March and we still are. And um, we, we first were using an oil that we tried to put in his juice, uh, which he would you know, spot immediately and not drink the juice. Uh, and then we tried to mix it into his ketchup because uh, he loves ketchup with his chicken nuggets and that, that didn't work out at all. He'd, he'd spot it and would, wouldn't eat it. And so Shannon found uh, gummy bears Shannon found gummy bears on uh, Amazon, and those he likes. And, you know, we haven't seen any side effects, and, and I have to say that his, you know, overall demeanor has been has been great. I mean, we've had, we've had an incredible summer. Now, I, I'm not about to say that that is, you know, completely, um, 
you know, the, the benefit from using the CBD oil because there's so many other factors that, that play into that, right? I mean, you know, I'm home all the time. Uh, Nicholas has a routine that, you know, really doesn't ask him to perform the, you know, the same types of tasks that he's doing throughout the school year. So it's, you know, obviously it's the middle of summer. It's, you know, there's a lot less stress in his life. And so that could be it. You know, obviously he's getting a little bit more mature, but you know, overall, I would have to say that, you know, we're not, we're, we're, we're definitely going to keep using it because, you know, his behaviors have improved. And again, like I said, I don't know if it's uh, solely because of the CBD oil, but, you know, Nicholas is doing great. So that's my take on it. And you know what? I, I, I'm certain, well, you know, who knows? There's a good chance I'm going to get hammered for making these, you know, these comments because, you know, like I said, this is way more controversial than I, than I thought. In fact, I mean, we were, I was talking about this exact topic on this Facebook page and a moderator came on and said, uh, well, we don't believe in CBD oil here and please don't talk about it. So that's, that's my take on it. Uh, so if you're watching my video, you get my opinion. Come on, man. Oreos and goldfish for all the swimmers. Nice job. Nice work. Hey, Nikki. Oreos and goldfish. Oreos and goldfish, absolutely. Did you, have, can you see? Good, Johnny, I'm not bothering you, am I? Okay. Uh, Nicholas, where are you? There you are. Okay, we'll get some Oreos and goldfish. Did you have fun swimming? Yes. You had a good time. Do you feel better now? I think you're a little cranky before, buddy. Okay, I'm gonna take that as a yes. So yeah, I think you did great, Nick. Let's go get some Oreos and goldfish. And then what are we gonna do? You wanna go home and, um, I don't know, go on the iPad? Yes. Okay, I like that idea. Great, all right, awesome. It'd be really ironic that we're talking about CBD oil today and uh, you know reducing anxiety and Nicholas is showing, you know, more anxiety today than he has, um, I don't know, I think really all summer. You know, it's kind of like, you know, this pacing around behavior, um, you know, the humming that he'll do to kind of block out you know, other things coming in. Um, you know, it just seems to be really irritable, uh, even getting out of the pool. And usually after swimming for a while, he's, you know, super calm and, and happy and well adjusted. But not today. And so who knows, maybe it's just one of those days that, uh, you know, he's just not feeling great. Hey, how you doing, handsome? You want Oreos and goldfish? Where are you? There you are. Yes, I have Oreos and goldfish and I'm gonna give you some. All right, buddy? But overall, look, it's still a great day. I mean, he went swimming, um, no meltdowns or anything. He just seems a little bit nervous. Uh, and so, you know, when, when he kind of behaves like this, we, I'm just gonna, you know, I'm gonna reduce what I demand of him and, and try to make everything as comfortable as possible for him. Um, and hopefully we'll avoid, you know, any, any incidents, uh, which I'm sure we will. Right, Nikki? Nikki, Nicholas, you happy boy? All right, <laughs> All right that's it for today. Thanks for tuning in. I, I hope you enjoy our videos. If you do, remember to subscribe and I look forward to seeing you next time. Nikki, you say bye-bye? Nikki, say bye-bye. Yeah. Maybe next time.